Hello everyone, Craig here, and uh, this video, uh, it's not a griefing video, the gameplay is and all that special. This is just meant to update you guys on some things that have happened to me in the past few weeks, and maybe go into detail about some stuff coming up uh, about what I have planned. Um, but while you listen to me, you can watch some pretty average noob tubing gameplay. Uh, isn't that exciting, right? Yeah. Anyway, uh, in the past few weeks, a few things have happened. Uh, about two weeks ago, I turned on my PS3, and it died on me. So that was awesome. It was pretty cool. Uh, then the next day, I turned on my Xbox to find that I had been suspended from Xbox Live um, for two weeks. The reason for that suspension was that I had the word fuck in my bio spelled backwards. Now... Your immediate thought may be, why did you have fuck spelled backwards in your bio? Uh, it was an in-joke from the game Shadows of the Damned. Most of you didn't play it, probably, so you don't get it. But, yeah, that's why it was there. And normally, I don't think Microsoft would pay much attention to that, but seeing as how I kind of make it a point to piss off a good number of people on Xbox Live on a weekly basis, they report me for stupid shit, but it just so happens that I had a violation, and, uh... Microsoft followed through and punished me. I am not upset with Microsoft. I, I have absolutely no ill will toward them over this. I violated the terms of service, and they and they acted. Like, I can't be mad at them for that. I think two weeks is a little harsh for a first violation, for an account that I've had for eight years, but whatever. It's their policy. I screwed up. My bad. Since, since then, I have gotten my account back. But uh, during that two weeks, the... the urge to make videos was kind of sucked out of me, because, like, my account was gone. So, yeah. So during that week, I, I, I think I made, like, two videos. I, I wasn't all that... wasn't all that excited to make another one. Um, but since then, I've gotten my account back. What made the ban, uh, or temporary suspension, rather, uh, what made that more tolerable is that literally the day after that, it was, it was a hell of a week, the day after that, I got an email from Machinima with, um, a contract. So, uh, some of you are already aware of this. I've stated it during live streams, uh, both Farva and Lost in Place it's live, uh, live streams. Um, I am now a Machinima partner. That stuff has gone through. That stuff is settled. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. Some of you may have noticed that, like, I have custom thumbnails for my videos now. Um, and that there are ads at the beginning of all the videos. Like, that is, that's the Machinima. So, that's great. That lifted my spirits quite a bit. And, uh, it was about goddamn time. No, I'm kidding. I'm I am just happy that I that that went through. I never expected that to happen. And I think getting a Machinima partnership in a year and a half, about since I started doing videos, I think that's a pretty respectable uh, accomplishment in that amount of time. So thank you to everyone who has subscribed to me, everyone who watches my videos, likes them, comments them. Because without you guys showing the support, Machinima wouldn't give me the time of day. So I do appreciate every everything that you guys have done for me. Um, and special thanks to Lost in Place and the Booster Busters in general, because they were a big help during this. Lost specifically. Like, without him, this never probably would have happened. He, he played a big part. So, that guy's awesome. Even if he's drunk. 95% of the time. And I don't think I'm exaggerating that number. Uh, what's going on in the future? Um, well, PAX is this weekend, actually. Uh, the Penny Arcade Expo, that is happening in Boston. And, uh, me and my friends are making the four and a half hour drive. We're gonna be leaving at 4.30 in the goddamn morning, which is not fun, but we're making the four and a half hour drive down to Boston, and, uh, we're gonna stay there the entire weekend. My goal originally, um was to write stuff for Fragnation.com, and I still plan on doing that. I have no idea how I'm going to handle it, because I'm not an official member of the press, so I'm just a guy at PAX. So, like, don't expect the interviews or any of that stuff to happen. I'm socially awkward, so that would be weird anyway, but I'm going to try and see what games that I can. I'm going to go to a bunch of panels, um, but if I see stuff that I find interesting, I'm going to write about it. I don't know if I'm going to do, like, a daily journal about my experiences at PAX and post that up on Fragnation, or if I'll just do individual games. I have no idea. I don't know how I'm going to cover it. I also don't know what the internet situation is going to be like there. Um, and my friend's bringing his laptop, but other than that, I have, like, I have no idea if, if is it going to be Wi-Fi, is it going to be free? Probably not. Uh, I'll figure it out. 
uh, an easier way to keep track of me. If you want to know what's going on at PAX, if you want to see my immediate thoughts on PAX, or if you just want to, you know, see my thoughts normally day to day, follow me on Twitter. Uh, I post it in my description all the time, but I've never made a big deal out of promoting it. But Craig AA on Twitter, link is in the description. I'm going to be tweeting all throughout PAX, and I do a decent amount of tweets in my spare time. If I see a movie, or if I play a game, I might tweet an immediate thought about it. Um, or I'll just post funny shit that pops into my head. Uh, it's really, I don't know. Like, what I post on Twitter is kind of random. But if you want to follow me, once again, link in the description. Uh, as for future content, I... People seem to like my noob tubing, but I don't want to just do that. I don't want that to get old. So, uh, I got NASCAR, which is a piece of shit. I cannot emphasize this enough. Do not buy NASCAR unless you're going to make videos about it, because it sucks so much. I don't know how anyone could like that game. I think I've stated that enough, but once again, NASCAR 2011, the game, is a piece of crap. Uh, but I'm going to try and make videos like that, uh, where I where I make people rage. Um, Farve and Coulter seem to be having fun doing it, so I'm going to try. I've been working on my redneck accent. Apparently, it's pretty good. Uh, Dan has told me that my accent is so good that it makes him hate me while I do it. Uh, so, you know, that, I guess that's a win in my book. I, I'm, yeah. uh, speaking of Dan, which, again, if you don't know who Dan is, Dirty Shizno 13 on YouTube. I'll put him in the description, too. Uh, you know, go check out his stuff. He doesn't do a ton of videos, but he is a funny guy, so go. Support him. He gave me the idea that maybe I should do a commentary series where uh, I tell stories about things that have happened in my life. Uh, Lost in Place did one uh, on his own a while ago. I think it was called um, Let's Get Drunk and Funk, I think it was. Uh, and my stories are not, like... <sighs> Lost in Place has had a rock star lifestyle, so most of my stories don't involve sexual conquest. <laughs> in fact, very few of them do. But, you know, just... Uh, Dan thinks that some of my stories are funny. Uh, whether they're just me being socially awkward and that causing interesting things to happen... Uh, there's the Italian girl story, which some of you know, but I never made a video about it, so that would be pretty entertaining, I think. Uh, but I, I, I don't know. We'll see how it pans out. Oh, and, uh, I've gotten some messages from people saying, Hey, uh, Craig, just to let you know, Gun Game is now a playlist in Modern Warfare 3. Why don't you bring back Humiliation Rage? Um, because the Gun Game in Modern Warfare 3 is bad. It's not well done at all. Everyone runs at the same speed. There is no animation. Like, when you get a kill with a gun, you instantly have the other gun in your head, uh, in your hand ready to fire. There is no animation. So, it sucks. So, don't expect that. It's a bummer, yeah, but what can you do? I didn't make the game. I wish I could change it, but I can't. And I'm out of time. So, I'm looking forward to PAX. Follow me on Twitter, and thanks again for watching.